Hey guys, I'm Glenn and today we're going to install a hidden camera inside a mailbox. My plan is to use a miniature bullet camera which measures from the front to the bracket just under 6 inches. This camera is a HD analog camera with a 2.8mm lens on it and it's 1080p. Here we have the BNC connector which is used for the video output and this one supplies power to the camera. Currently the camera I have installed is a low resolution camera and it doesn't have as wide angle as I need. So if you're wondering how did I get a cable to the mailbox, luckily I have three category cable coming from the house to this AT&T box, which I spliced a direct barrier cat to it and trenched that along the edge of the house and along the edge of the driveway all the way to the mailbox. First thing first, I need to get this camera down much smaller than what it is now, so I removed the wall bracket and the arms from the camera. While doing this, I noticed that the connectors on the cable was much larger than the hole in the arms. So I'm planning on opening up the camera to remove the cable from the opposite end. So my plan failed because they had some kind of glue inside the camera and I don't want to jeopardize the warranty on this camera. So I'm just going to put the camera back together and go to plan B. The body on this camera is a bit bigger than the one that was installed previously so I'm going to have to open up the hole a little bit. I'm hoping I can just mark the edge and notch that out to get the camera in. But first I must get the cables out of the way so I don't nick them. My plan almost worked but because I have a 4x4 inside this post which is holding the entire mailbox up. It act as a second layer which mean I would have to have a perfect hole from the outside all the way in and my hole was not perfect. This mean I had to have a bigger hole than I anticipated but it's workable. After I verified that the camera worked I taped up my connections to reduce exposure from the elements. Since I couldn't get the arms off the camera, plan B is to push the arms inside the post. Since I have the camera hooked up to my video recorder, I use my phone as a monitor to fine tune the camera's position. I use a flexible blank plate which I took a wood bit to drill out the hole in the center. I drilled the hole slightly bigger than the glass because I do not want to block the infrared lights on the camera. Install the plate and this one is complete. Thanks for checking out this video. If you have any question on what I did in this video, ask me a question down in the comment. Leave me a thumbs up. And also, before you leave, don't forget to hit the subscribe button over here. And be sure you check out some of my other videos and I will catch you on the next one. And before you leave, make sure you hit the subscribe button.